Ridge. Well, 7.30. Jared, Tony, and Charlie just leaving Little Rock to head over, or sorry, just leaving Russellville headed to Little Rock to go start our day. The demo, we're still on that demo project, probably take another today and tomorrow to finish. So now it's mostly just hauling away day as fast as we can back and forth to the dump. Dump's like 45 minutes, I think, something like that. Jared's on his phone. So we'll see how it goes. Well, I just spilled water all over myself. I was trying to drop one of these uh, tablets. It's kind of like an airborne tablet, just a knockoff version of it. Into this water, when I pushed down on it to kind of get it to squeeze in there, shot water all over my pants. So I had the, uh, the really great idea to hurry up and sweep the water off of my pants before, the, um, before it kind of like set in to my pants, or soaked into my pants, I mean. And when I did that, I shoved all of the uh, pills onto the floor and basically threw out an entire bottle. And now my pants are just soaking wet. They'll dry, it's just water, it's not that big of a deal, but I was just like, God damn it. Had to happen, knew it. But they all fell on the floor. I saved one of them, barely got any dirt on it. And I just said, ah, the hell with it. Little tiny speck of dirt and it's probably not gonna kill me. So I made it anyways. Luckily enough, there's a Walgreens, a CVS, and everything right down the street right here from the job, so I can pop in there and get some more. I'm actually sick, so I'm trying to take a couple of immune boosters to at least give my uh, body a fighting chance for not getting whatever she got. She goes to the doctor here in a little bit and finds out if she's got the flu or not. So I figure I'll just give my body a little boost today, and I did yesterday as well, but I forgot the pills at home yesterday or this morning, I mean, the ones that I bought yesterday. So now I'll have to just pop in somewhere and grab some more. <sighs> but damn it, <laughs> it's not a great feeling to soak your pants like that, but yeah, it happens. It's water, it'll dry. Well, this house demo is coming along nicely. Just flat out no more house. We don't have a whole lot of left material to go through. Today and maybe a little bit tomorrow and I think we'll be done with this project. So, coming along very well. Very happy with that. Well, I'm just waiting just outside of the dump for Charlie to get over here. I didn't take a whole lot of video today. Um, just been driving, I'm in, the, I'm in the granite right now. So I'm just kind of in the little dirt area right next to the, uh, yeah, I guess you call it a landfill, whatever this place is. They closed here seven minutes ago. So I was just kind of waiting for Charlie to get here, figure out where we're gonna park for tonight. Uh, I guess this teardown might have been a little bit contested, to say the least. So, I'm not going to say a lot about it. I'm probably not going to shoot any more video on this, but there's some kind of other stuff going on that really makes me question things. So, I was just going to leave it alone and uh, kind of pick back up shooting more video when things are a little bit, you know, calm down, I guess. These guys aren't supposed to be coming in here. Oh, they're just turning around. That's all. So, don't want to get involved. Don't want to deal with any of it. So, I'm just leaving all of it alone. So, for now, today, and we'll have to finish up a little bit tomorrow. 
we'll just be uh, just be driving, dumping and whatnot. Need to get a new lens for this thing. I scratched my Max lens the other day, and I've been trying to fix it. Haven't haven't been able to fix it. I think I might have made it worse. Ashley got confirmed she has influenza A, and I'm trying not to get it, but I know I'm going to get it. Every time the flu comes about, I get it. So there's no there's no ifs ands or buts. I'm going to end up getting sick in the next couple of days. Influenza A doesn't sound too terribly bad this year. So, we, uh, I'm not too concerned about getting it, but I'm trying to just avoid it for best as possible. Went and got some, uh, airborne gummy things, immune boosters, and I've been sleeping in the living room, and I've been spraying everything down very well with Lysol and, uh, oh, I forgot the name of that other stuff. Lasts for like 24 hours. I went and got all that and I'm trying to keep things clean and sanitized as much as a one bedroom apartment can, can be. And then we'll uh, see if I can stay away from her and try not to get sick and hopefully that might help. might work out. I might only got a little bit of the virus and maybe my body fought it off, but I doubt it. That's not how things work. But I'm headed back over. We're gonna park our cars or park the trucks for the night. I'm pretty sure we're done in this last run. The uh, hour and a half home. And then I can go and kind of take care of Ashley. Maybe I'll end up just being sick tomorrow in general. I feel all right right at the moment, but who knows how influenza ends up going. I might end up getting super sick here in the next 12 to 24 hours. So, cross my fingers, hope that's not going to happen. Hope I can just beat it. But you never know. So, head back, park, and start heading back to Russellville. Watches the vlog. I wonder if he's gonna see this. He wants to see roll pop. Love these things. Have one or two of them a day. What? Huh? Thank you.